And now we're gonna start getting attacked by the KKK. Because they don't want us here, they don't want us knowing the secrets. Alright guys, welcome to another episode of Dark Souls. Now today, uh, well, as you know, we're now in in Orlando. My main goal is I want to try and find uh, Guinevere. Um, there's also the Gwendolyn fight that you can do, but I would personally wait till further in the game for that. Just because I don't feel like dealing with Dark and Orlando. It is not a happy, safe time. <laughs> but, anyways, so, here we go. And down here, there should be a fucking one of these guys. But, unlike earlier in the game, he doesn't get back up. So, that is somewhat helpful. Uh, want to cut your tail off? There we go. I got a tail axe. I got a tail axe. I wonder if this one's actually... Oh, shit. Any better than the one that I had had before. Also, the gargoyles are much weaker than they were before. Alright, now we go to our swerve, I think. Um... Ah, uh, that's right, staircase. Although, there is another little area over there I could go to. First, let's see what's down here. It's been so long since I've been to this area so that I don't necessarily remember everything. So, I just like to make sure I look around just to be safe. Okay, you're an actual chest, so I'll play with you. Demon Titanite! But also referring back to the Gwendolyn boss battle. If you guys remember um, before when we were in the uh, catacombs, the reason that I went there before I came over here, or most other parts of the game for that matter, was because of the Moonlight Seance Ring that's down there. Basically what that does is it allows you to access the Fog Door to get to the Gwendolyn boss battle. And also to join the Dark Moon Covenant if you so desire. Alright, I'm walking around in circles here. But I'm pretty sure... Now we just come up on here. Parkour skills. Whoop. Yeah, got it. For a second there, I thought I was screwed. And now we're going to start getting attacked by the KKK. Because they don't want us here. They don't want us knowing the secrets. And what I like to do is I like to piss these guys off first. Because otherwise when we go up there, they're just going to be dicks. And there's more further along, but I can't quite get them just yet. And I don't remember how to knock the chandelier down, but I'm pretty sure it's a simple game mechanic of hit the fucking chain. Okay, okay. He's getting a little stabby. There we go. Pillage the body for weapons that I don't care about. 
but yeah. I mean, this is really the hardest part of this spot is dealing with these guys. sit there and keep taking chances with hits that I might not make. I will do this. Huzzah! Called it. Now, we get them. Unless that happens. Whoa! Cool. I wasn't expecting to win that like that. I thought I was just going to aggro them and cause them to come at me. So, you can only imagine how happy I am that I accomplished that. See, like this guy. Yeah, they'll just kind of be dickish. And there we go. So now that they're out of the way, we can proceed. Do, 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 do. Ooh, chest. I wonder how it does get to. Okay, I see a staircase there, so... Obviously, there's an alternative way through all this. But I'm going to go over here. Ooh, more stairs. Hello. Ow. Ow. Okay. So, slow attacks are not going to be beneficial to me right now. There we go. Now that he is dead, let's go down here and see what was so important. Besides a whole lot of nothing. So they are not illusionary, illusionary, hallucinogen. They are real walls constructed by hard-working men. And women. Ooh, what does this lever do? It does not move. Well, that's useful. Who the hell designed that? Now we can use this, but I want to see what's down here fast. So many stairs. Looks like they don't connect to shit. So, we will just have to play with it. Flying buddies. Let's do this. Now, oh, twisting it once, I believe, will take you either to Guinevere or straight to the Orange Sheen and Small Battle. First, we're going to take it down one more level. Because there's another bonfire. And we will keep going, I just want to get it activated. And the bonfire I'm about to go to and show you guys is actually just before um, the Gwendolyn boss battle. Ring of the Sun's Firstborn. <laughs> Which, 
according to rumor of the lore of Gwyn's um, children, it's speculated that his um, basically his disowned son is actually um, Solaire. And there's other things I could nitpick to show, you know, that'll help show kind of the reasoning behind it, but I'd rather, I mean, we can get into that more later, but for now, I'll leave it up to interpretation and just kind of let everyone else's minds have a little bit of fun with that. Now we go back up here. Okay, let's see what's in here. Oh my god, it's the rest of the clan. We can actually, in, an, in a later episode, we'll actually be going into that painting. Oh, hello. Anyways, we're going to go into the painting. To the painted world. Which was actually the um, first level that the developers actually made for Dark Souls. It was kind of used as like a testing ground. It's actually really, really well designed level too. Like you could tell that they took their time with it instead of just, oh, we gotta make this for the game so we can show off, you know, all the potential. Alright. Why do I keep picking up shit that these guys drop when I know they're just gonna be worthless ass throwing knives that I don't care about? I wonder how they feel about fire. Let's ask. How? Apparently they don't like fire. Not at all. Not even a little. Okay. You're making me feel a little swarmed here, guys. You wanna give me some room to breathe? Thanks. All the king's horses and all the king's clan just couldn't fuck me up, man. Kick you. Okay, okay, I'm fucking up. So there's another one back there, but we'll just worry about this guy for now. Do 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 something, bro. And that is the body of Iron Tarkus. Which is how we just got all of his armor. Excuse me, sir. Are you prepared to die? Apparently not. Let me guess, more daggers, right? throwing knife whatever same difference you know what I meant now onward gotta go back up a level Whee! So I think that's how you get to Orange Sheen and Smoke. Oh god, gargoyles. Oh shit. Where did you come from? Come on, just. There we go. There you are, dick. So can he just. I wonder if he can regen after. You use the uh, bonfire. Because that's kind of cheap if you can, but at the same time, Dark Souls. Okay. The whole you being OP as fuck thing. Just, yeah. Not having it. 
Not having it, man. Oh god, which door should I choose? Contraption does not move. Okay then. Well, I see a bonfire up here, so I'm going to use it. I thought I saw a bonfire, but it ended up being kind of more of a death trap. Oh, don't worry about me. I wish not to fuck with you boys. So, we gotta figure out how to use these contraptions. That's what I gotta do. Okay, that's where I started from, so I wonder if there's a place to go from down here. Oh yeah, that's right, that's where we just were. But there's also a lever that doesn't work. Hmm. Very peculiar. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this back down. Unless it decides to move upward. So, like I said, we're taking it back down. And then we'll just continue tomorrow and hopefully we'll have a better idea of where to go. See either that or I'll continue this after having a quick cigarette. Not quite sure. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, never mind. I had false hope in myself for a second there. So I'm going to take me a quick smoke break and either we'll continue this tonight or I'll just pick up on it tomorrow. So, I love you, Hyaniacs, and I'll see you guys later.